Um, I was beyond excited. You know, Coach Ross told me, and it's just it's such a humbling experience and just an awesome opportunity to represent Lindenwood University and, uh, and just in a positive way. So. Uh, definitely, it's you know, it's not about me. It's definitely this program. Um, we are the way we are, just because of the, the values that they teach us here, and just uh, I, I just I'm just thankful for the staff, just everyone trying to get our name out there, and so I'm just uh, humbled to to be able to represent us. So um, I don't look at it as as me at all. I just look at it as our team and our family. So. Really, they just say, you know, serve the ones that come out here and support you every weekend. And so uh, it's really, you know, he's like, hey, we have a list of events if anybody wants to attend them. And it's uh, none of our stuff is mandatory, but you still get a turnout of about 50, 50 plus guys coming out to all these events to help support whenever we can. So because all these guys come out here and support us on Saturday, so it's not a problem at all for us to come out and help them whenever they need it. Well, it's an outstanding accomplishment, not only for Malik, but for our entire program. This is the, the second guy we've had that, have had that has the honor of the, the Good Hands team. So we're extremely proud and excited for the, for the guys we have in our program and for Malik to represent us. Really, it happens in the recruiting process. We try to find guys that already have done good things, guys that are good people, guys that come highly recommended by their coaches and anybody else we come in contact with. So really a lot of it takes place in the recruiting process. We bring in those kids to the program and then once a year obviously we encourage them to do the right thing and do the, do the most they can to give back and to help.